ready for the greatest adventure of our lives. Yeah, we're ready for a big one. This is what we've been waiting for since I watched the first Eco Challenge yeah. in my living room when I was 16. Right here, this moment. crevasses. The Alaska wilderness is just full on. Marco fell into a crevasse. When you set off an SOS on your spot, that means it's imminent death. They need immediate rescue. Uh, it's pretty cloudy up here right now. There's a lot of fog. I don't see anybody yet. Marco! You're all right, buddy. We're going to get you out. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh, I've never pack rafted before. I had never seen an iceberg before. And we got right up on one. I've been on some class five rapids and I am still really scared. It's pretty intense. We just swam through a half a kilometer of glacial water. <laughs> when you're in this type of terrain, things go bad really fast. My feet have uh, some kind of fungal infection. If it is not brought under control, it will consume my foot. The river is very deceiving. It, it looks uh, like it's flat and calm. The water is actually moving very rapidly. We had some serious gear issues and medical issues. I had a asthma attack up there. I'm trying to put his shoulder back where it belongs. Some of these issues. Get her in that boat. Let's go. I'm too heavy in the boat. My knees are smacking every. Right now we're looking at about an 80 mile bike with a lot of elevation gain and collectively only seven working legs. The expedition aspect is that we traveled areas that nobody else has ever been. That's what makes it unsafe, that's what makes it unknown, and that's what makes it appealing. And in this style race, finishing as a team is truly winning.